Taylor here with AgriSpray Drones. Now, one of the most important things when it comes to a spray drone is how do you transport it and how do you carry it? Now, you're not lifting this thing very often. You're not transporting it very often. It's flying most of the time, but you have to get it to and from the field safely and quickly and pack it in and out of the truck. Now, normally, whenever we're operating off the top of the trailer, we'll land it up there and lock it down up there. In the back of a truck with the Roadrunner, it actually fits pretty nice and J100 actually clears most truck beds here on the back end. We don't typically strap it in here because it is mostly secure against the tailgate and the front. Um, but if you are going in the back of a truck, I do highly recommend that you do strap it down if it's loose in the back of there. We strap typically either over the landing gear right here or move the props out of the way and strap right over here over uh, the arms right next to the uh, locking collar and between the tank and the battery charger. That way it locks your arms in, doesn't put pressure on the hinge of the arm and it locks the drone in. I don't recommend strapping down over the props as you can bend them. So as far as getting out of the truck with two people, obviously that's pretty easy. With one person, a bit more difficult. It's gonna weigh about 80 pounds whenever it is uh, empty and with no battery. But I just like to grab by the front here and then pick it up on the LiDAR side, the front of the drone. Just watch out for this camera. It's not gonna hit the truck, but it might hit your knee or your leg. Pull it out, kind of tilt it down to where you can grab onto the top and just grab right around these props here. That way you lock the props in with your arms. Then you can just rest it against your stomach and pick it up like that. It works the same way going into the truck. You can grab it from the back as well, but it does kind of pinch your legs in between here. And you got fat legs like me, it's not too easy. Uh, so we do typically try to pick it up uh, from the front. It's the same thing going back into the truck. Wrap your arms around it and grab on the bottom side of the drone arms. Rest the landing gear up, and then slide it in. If we're transporting it a long distance across the shop or the floor, we'll just use a dolly and go right underneath of our landing gear. Okay, that's a pretty simple tutorial on how to carry your J100. Thanks.